right, boys, it's time for free agency. Now, I was asking you guys in the last video, we got two players to sign here. We have 40, uh, 48 players under contract, so we only have room for two players. All right, um, I think I'm going to skip on the offseason trade this year. I don't re really want to trade anyone away just yet, and all of our young guns, they can still get a lot better, okay? So their trade value isn't as good as it could be. We're still in the slow rebuild, all right, but I think I'm going to give Granlund and Connolly the shot this year. But I do need two defensemen, all right? We only have four NHL-ready defensemen. Um, I could start Bar Barbario, but I'd rather have all 80 defensemen, all right? Um, now, since I can only sign two players, there was one guy with good potential, this Essler guy. Uh, Danny Essler, center, two-way forward. Okay, the only reason his potential was that good is because the A- minus for athleticism. He's actually nothing too special for us. So, I'm not going to sign any young guns. Alright, we're only going to waste the uh, two contracts on NHL-ready defensemen right now, okay? So, we said we were going to get Brad Stewart, no doubt. He's 33 years old, we can sign him to a three-year deal, and then at the end of the third year, trade him away. Um, or, uh, like when Jordan Subban's ready to come up, when the Stamkos contract needs to be done. This, this guy's a great defensive defenseman, and he's actually got a pretty good offensive category as well. Perfect for penalty kill, perfect for that third-line defensive core, okay? Brad Stewart, and he actually still has all of his C-minuses, and he wants three years. He is kind of expensive, but that's okay. We have $11 million, almost $12 million to work with. We have no major contracts coming up until Stamkos's, so I'm okay with this, all right? So three years for Brad Stewart. And we're going to offer him three years at five mil because I want to make sure that I get this guy, okay? Three years at five mil. There you go. And we're going to need one more defenseman. Now, you guys were saying Mark Streit. Mark Streit is a good a good defenseman. The only thing is he's 35. I don't want the same thing to happen as last year. And he has all of his D potentials, right? Um, I want a defenseman that I can hold on to through the playoffs and who will still be good next year so that I can trade him away. I don't want to have another Lidstrom where I have to trade him away at the trade deadline or I have to keep him and basically win the Stanley Cup. Because if I don't win the Stanley Cup and he retires, it's basically just a waste. So, Mark Streit is a good offensive defenseman, but we already have a good offensive defenseman in Ekman Larson. All right, I'd rather get a better player in the defensive category, so hang on a sec. Vizhnovsky, I think he's, yeah, offensive defenseman, same thing. Uh, and he's actually older than Streit. Uh, Jordan Leopold, 32 years old, two-way defenseman. All right, this guy's a bit better, good discipline. He's actually pretty good offensively as well. Jordan Leopold, he might be someone good. Uh, Rob Scuderi, uh, defensive defenseman, we know what this guy's about. He's 34, he's pretty good. I actually think I'd rather Jordan Leopold o over uh, Scuderi, though. Uh, Mara, not bad. Scuderi's better than him. Corey Sarich, not bad. All right, so it looks like it's between Jordan Leopold and Rob Scuderi. Since we have the money, let's go for Jordan Leopold, okay? Yeah, let's go for Jordan Leopold. He only wants one year. Uh, let's give this guy, yeah, we'll give him one year. Yeah, sure, we'll give him one year at four mil. All right, there you go. All right, so we pretty much can't sign anyone else. Now, if one of these guys don't sign... That's going to suck because other players might be taken. So hopefully, either they accept it or they don't accept it, but they give me the answer within three or four days. All right, so here we go. Let's start the simulation. Come on. I gave you guys a lot of money there. Come on. Especially Brad Stewart, man. Three years at five mil, that's 15 mil. Come on. Jordan Leopold. All right, so we got Jordan Leopold. Good two-way defenseman. He can play alongside Kevin Shattenkirk. Two two-way defensemen, two Americans. Perfect. Keep simulating here. And, oh, Brad Stewart. But we have a full roster. What? Players under contract. We only we have 49 players under contract. Oh, hang on a second here. Hang on. I don't know what the hell's going on. It says 49 players under contract. How do I have a full roster? Is he still here? Please, God, let him still be here. Brad Stewart, all right, he's still here. Let me try to sign him again. I'm going to have to figure out, maybe I have to make an off-season trade here just to free up some space. All right, so there's Brad Stewart again. Unless I have a, a player that, no, 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 I don't, though. I don't have any restricted free agents. Hang on, let me go to contracts. I know if you have a restricted free agent, that counts as a player, but I only have rookies that haven't been signed. These guys don't count as players. Goaltender? I don't know who it is. It says 49 players. That's weird. All right, so let's uh, make an off-season trade. Let's just get rid of some uh, crappy guys, basically, for like a seventh or something. We'll hold on to our goalies. Defenseman. Go down here. Yeah, these guys can go away. Sabe. Let's see how good this guy is. Uh, BB, uh, he can stay. 
Milan, I think Milan can go, absolutely. Oh, uh, yeah, Milan can go. Oh, excuse me. Milan can go. Weller could go. All right, Weller could go. Uh, Zamorowski. Let's see, Peter Zamorowski. Uh, defensive, defense. Yeah, he can go as well. There you go. We'll just dump a bunch of these defensemen down here. It's okay. Saxford Danielson can stay. Landry, he wasn't that good, was he? Uh, no, we can get rid of Landry as well. Perfect. All right, that's perfect. We'll get rid of four players. So that'll free up some uh, roster space here. So Anaheim, yep. Let's just go for a fifth, a sixth, and a seventh. Will it go through? Yes, it did. If I didn't accept this offer, you're yours. Yep, the Anaheim Ducks, blah, blah, blah. All right, so we freed up some space now. We have 46 players. Uh, Eight million left to work with. Perfect. Now that actually we freed up some space here, hang on a sec. I don't need another defenseman because we're getting Brad Stewart. I, I already sent him the, uh, yeah, I already sent him the contract. Um, what about forwards? If there's any chief, Antropoff, I won't be able to sign him. Shane Doan I could sign. I can get Shane Doan again. Let's see. D minus, D minus. No, no, you know what? I don't need Shane Doan. No, I don't need him. Peros, Cam Jansen, uh, Chad LaRose. Ooh, he's a pretty good grinder, Chad LaRose. Look at that. Yeah, Chad LaRose is a pretty good grinder, man. Yeah, we'll get Chad LaRose. Why not? One way. Ooh, a lot of teams want him. Um, I'll give you one way at two mil. There you go. It's probably going to hurt my uh, GM reputation. I don't care, though. All right. Oh, actually, you know what I'll do? Yeah, since we have... Let me just simulate one more day because I actually need a backup for this year because I don't think Malcolm Subban's ready to... He, I, I think he's still going to be in the juniors. Let's uh, get Brad Stewart... And Chad LaRose signed, and then we'll see how much money we have left, and then we'll get a backup goalie. Uh, a backup goalie or an AHL starter goalie, okay? Come on, Brad Stewart. Come on, there you go. All right, so we got Brad Stewart. We still have 3.39 mil. Uh, let's go in and get a goalie. Goalie is, let's see here. Uh, oh, Tim Thomas is available. Yeah, we'll get Tim Thomas. Perfect. All right, 86 overall. We bring his Stanley Cup experience to our team. I'll give you a 2.25. There you go, Timmy. Timmy T. And that should be enough now. Hopefully my, ro no, my roster shouldn't be full. Yeah, it was full at 49. I don't know why it was full. I don't have any uh, uh, tender qualifying offers. Tim Thomas. All right, so there you go. We got our team. Perfect, perfect. So let us simulate all the way up, and uh, let's get our team ready to start the season. We'll get that all done, and we'll also get the uh, AHL team ready, all that good stuff, all right? So here we go.